Hey there, everyone. This is Aokao playing the via Zelda Map 2 with the spicy audio because it's too loud on the latter two weeks. I don't know why. All right, we're going to be beating the game, like, almost absolutely definitely. Um, how's it going? <laughs> we're just kind of going to head there. We're going to take the portal at the beach to go back. Whoops, wrong place. To go back. Uh, to Death Mountain, and then we're gonna go on the other side of Death Mountain, you know, we're gonna turn right instead of turning left, it's going to lead us to all the greatest glories the universe can provide, maybe. I don't know what any of that meant. I got the golden sword, I got the red shield, and it's true, I guess in theory, that's supposed to be useful for the boss gauntlet that you found at the end of Dungeon 8. But I keep doing Dungeon 8 before doing Dungeon 7, so it ends up not being relevant. That's a little bit funny. Look at that. Destroy these things. One shot. Here we go. One shot. Here we go. Lionel. More like Lionel. That doesn't mean nothing. It doesn't matter. It's what I said anyways. Uh, so, uh, yeah, Legend of Zelda, this was really nice to re-explore, like, it is a game of my childhood, and, I don't know, like, I, I feel like I don't know what it is to play Legend of Zelda f for the first time, cause, like, my, my run of Matt, well, of, well, the first quest, well, went pretty well, but partly because, like, exactly, like, I know exactly what needs to happen. Uh, I feel like we got a closer approximation of what it's like to play the game for the first time when I played uh, the second quest. And I don't know if I like the second quest, I'm gonna be real, but I do think that um, it was interesting. I was secretly hoping this would be where um, <laughs> the, the hard piece I don't know where it is would be, but no. It's just a secret for everybody. I think I'm just not gonna get the last heart. Like, I don't know where it is. I guess it could be here somewhere. Alright, let's bomb those walls. Hey, look at that. A hole in the wall. Whoa! Yeah, last minute shop. I could buy keys. I could buy all the keys if I wanted. I'm not going to do that. That would be foolish. Alright, here's another zone. Alright, nothing here. Okay, nothing here. All right. Get a rock on your head. Don't even feel it. Doubtful that there'd be anything, but... Man, we are just, like, going around in, like, circles. But, like, you know, like a like a snail spiral. Whoa, check it out. It's Dungeon 7. Yeah, Dungeon... Uh, second quest was interesting. Oh, okay, that's the healer one. It's pretty good. I don't know what land we're into, or what we're doing, really. Gonna go again and try to bomb this. Yay, did it. Alright, welcome to a new place. Whoa, lava, unbelievable. I'm gonna put a bomb here, no way. Destroy and kill all at once. I will attempt to take the opportunity. Even if it doesn't say. Alright, did it did it Whoops. Yeah, did that was that not the sound of a secret or something? I don't know. Alright, uh it's a pretty pretty odd place, but here we are. Alright, welcome to the pancake factory where we pancake and they ooze around on the rail. It's pretty good. Oh no! Okay, nothing here. Is this it, 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 it. Ah, oh, come on. Do I? Must for I? Instant, I saw the evil king heading for the red ring and magical sword. Oh no, he'll be disappointed. Both must have been taken by now. Yes. Let's now use the spell of whispering again. Okay. Use it to find your hidden allies. Okay, yeah, that thing, right? Right. <laughs> Have to chat. This is it's weird. That the old man Why would you just put this before? diamond pattern here? There are various things hidden under trees and in the go. You should hear a strange noise when you come to Dark your blue. 
Something you have not found yet is concealed in them. Oh no. Use your candle and bombs to reveal them. I'll do that later. If I do it. <laughs> I don't know if I will. Right, yo. Oh, that's a blob. <laughs> I guess it's a D. <laughs> it's a very sickly D. That D has seen better days. Uh, right about here, why not? Yeah, Alright, well, hey, we'll keep on walking, you know? Keep on exploring the zone. Alright, might as well stop time. I'll go back down. Oh, there's a down way at the bottom I didn't go to either that might have something. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's, it's, um, it's a shape. What if the map was shaped like a shape? Look, it's better than yet another M. I agree. Uh, there will be no debate there, but, oh boy. <laughs> it's looks so sloppy. Yeah, so I bombed them here, and this was like a special treat. But what if you follow the path logically? You end up here where wizards roam. Oh my gosh, it's a hippodrome. It's really not, but there's a log door here that you can use. You end up somewhere where there's news. News is mummies are dumb. You just walk around. Thanks for the late clock, idiot. All right, what's over here? Okay, so over there is the, uh, whoops, is the uh, intro zone. Go stab the wizard in the face. Look, might have a drop. He did not have a drop. Yeah, to the side is the entry room, which we have not access to. All right, well, uh, welcome to this path. Uh, we're gonna warp to somewhere unknown. That's the way back. Uh, yeah, so, destroying the wizard. Oh, actually did have a drop associated with it. I didn't expect that. Alright, why not? Like, I'm probably gonna get there from the other side. But you don't know, actually. Uh, Twin Patra, they just kind of came right at me and then are not being effective at all. They just stopped in front of me and then hovered there. Very effective method of combat. If I do say so myself. If I may opine. Alright, well, uh, here's this. Okay. It's not impossible that you could go through. Okay. Right into the darkness, huh? Alright. I mean, look, if it looks like a hallway, I will investigate. Oh, it's that kind of fairy? <laughs> Alright. That's pretty good. <laughs> sure, in this nondescript room, why not? I have more of these. Best flavor in Super Zone. I'm doing this because I don't want to walk back. Hey, and I was right. <laughs> ah, but you have to do that actually if you want to go through the turnstile. Okay, that's that's clever. I just kind of ended up going through it backwards, but yeah, no, this is meaningful because then you can push a thing to side and uh, you'll be able to... well actually you could just return here maybe maybe no no yeah yeah you can just destroy bats to pave your way all right you didn't need to go through all of that actually but it's fun to think about uh, dark nuts in a room what are you gonna do about that dark nuts are they just I don't know I feel like something changed about them they feel a lot safer to fight. I don't know what it is about them. It's just something. Alright, wizard and pancake. Together at last. Wait. Wait. Rejoice, hero. Rejoice. The power of the stars uh -huh. that guide you now flows in my body. Oh, I got a mega big ring. Oh, 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 oh. This power is magnificent. <laughs> Up to this point, I have used all of my abilities for you. Uh huh. But one at a time. Using this power, you can decide the outcome of your battles in a single blow. No, he does not give me the ability to slay my foes in a single blow. Now is our chance. You can use all of these abilities at once with this. You can throw your oh, sword boy. even without full power. Oh boy. Moreover. 
bombs and arrows are infinite. And you can use the magical Let's put bombs. Let's try and challenge the remaining Anything dungeons here? with this opportunity. So, this had no purpose. Uh, it lets me go down here, which is this, this, this ladder. So this had a purpose, actually. You fool! Here's where there's a red candle at! Yeah! We love red candles. Alright, now we can burn the entire universe if we feel like it. I don't know if I will feel like it, but if I ever did... Uh, Now's the time. Okay, I think I need to, like, now double back, and we will do that. Look at that. I didn't even let the door close. Whoa, who's that? It's Ganon. That voice just now. It's Ganon. The evil king? Yep, that's him. For him to show up at last. I wonder if where, where he said, he? like, I where feel something he? nearby or whatever, is a hint that he's coming over to, uh... With the old man zone. Like, if it is, it's not something I thought about at the time. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm like filling up knees. I didn't go to the side here from the start, and I want to do that. There are like two rooms here. See this guy, the fight again, and one needs the silver arrow. See, I can't live without knowing that information. So I'm glad I did, and then here's this compass zone. Whoa. Are you excited about compass zone? I sure am. Alright, we're going there now. Unbelievable. I am full of unbelieving. Hey, by Ganon. You know, one needs the silver arrow. Great! I didn't need to do that. I did that for fun. Get out of here. Alright. So, right. Is there any difference between going to the side or going up? I don't think there is. You just you get to choose which format of Dark Knight you want to fight. And I've never been here. Alright, back to our exploration of this space. Gebdos. Whoa, unbelievable. That was Gebdos. Remember to push the block to get a thing. Bomb here. There's a room to the side. It's worth checking. And I, wait, there's a ladder. There's a there's a stair that appeared, but I kind of I did not notice. Like I saw the door open up, and I was like, oh yeah, that's what I expected. Didn't expect the stairs. Uh, it's, it's gonna be like a trap. Maybe. Like I don't know, man. It's gonna say wait. Oh my gosh. You despicable fiend. I see. You think you can win if you quickly seal my power? I won't let you have your way. The power of the stars flows in my body now. You will not be able to seal my power so easily. Wha what are you doing? Let go. Let go. Hero. Hero. The silver arrows. The silver arrows. Something serious has happened. How many takes man. do you think that took? Has it's pretty good. Like, this is some, yeah, that's places. what I thought. Some sure pretty good theater places. here. Without them, Best I've be seen in a while. Uh, due to me not really being into theater all that much. <laughs> that's mostly why. Alright, well, I, you know what? I had to check. I could have not check. But I had a feeling. That's fine. Alright, keep getting me bombs. I mean, bombs are good. Like, I'm not gonna complain about adding more bombs. That, I don't, I don't got, I don't need them right now. No, don't try to pull a thing until, alright. This music that's playing, the one everyone loves, the one with the weird laser sounds. I don't really the get it. The thing we heard from the old man was him crying for the silver arrows. Yeah, what a baby. The silver arrows are in the level 8 dungeon. If you have them, as well as the eight Triforce pieces, oh. hurry to the old man's cave. Alright, how are you gonna have all of them at this point? That doesn't make any sense to me. Alright, I'll spend the key here. It's gonna go down, alright? This is a curse, but this is like a curse curse. Alright, two little slimes just kinda chillin'. Alright, doing their best in this room. Manhala's here, huh? That's great. 
Happy Manhandle Day, everyone. What I thought. This is going to lead the where uh, the end probably is at, right? Probably. Yeah. Okay. I want to check out the rest, though. I don't know why. Their rooms are probably not going to be interesting, but I gotta. I have to. Look at this little guy. He's doing his best. So what happens if you go on the other side here? Which is the more straightforward way? The Triforce has to be complete! To defeat Ganon! Thanks! Try letting yourself be captured by a wall master. Yeah, try to do that. There must be a room where oh, a different okay. colored wall I don't want to be healed. It's a, bit, it's a bit of overkill. Oh my gosh, it's the tiny slime room. Everyone's favorite. And this is nothing. There is nothing to do from here. I think this is, by design, just kind of a dead end. Well, like, they didn't even do anything with it. It's just, yeah, check it out. I don't know, man. But I checked it out, and I don't know, man. I feel like the constant use of ladders is making my method of exploring to always go, like, away from where the shiny thing is. Is like in a constant state of backfiring. Look at that! Now you're red. You shot five shots. Pretty impressive. Good job, Dragon Face. All right, we're going to this version of the song. I mean, I have less than ten minutes left, man. To find where the old man lives, I'm gonna go stab a pig in the face. Whoa! It's dark. A ghost is out. I caused that ghost to be by touching the grave. Uh, yes, siree. All right, well, let's kind of go. The secret here. But where? I tried to bomb everywhere, then I. Well, I'm gonna keep trying. Yeah. Oh, did I seriously not try this? There's money you can find in the wall. Yeah, accurate. Going. No reason to do One day, this then I need I I pretty sure I tried everywhere. You cannot put a bomb up there. I guess my canvassing was kinda bad. Oh great! So sad I almost missed out on this secret. Oh. Alright, my life is now much improved. Get out of here. No, we still have a wavy effect in spite of the the storm. Yeah, I feel like map two is like more finished, like cause it's got like that effect. Uh, you have the fact that the whirlpool that like you know gets in the way of the um, raft is like a unique graphic and not just a reuse of the Zora whirlpool. So I feel like map two is like more finished. It's just that gameplay-wise, it's it really is just more of the same. Oh, your bald head looks kind of funny at this angle. That's a pretty good scene. All right, now we are not being broadcast audio from the satellite. We are disconnected. We are now using the music that is in the cartridge instead. Away from CD quality and back on the SFC. Cool little animation. And then, yeah, it's just instant, instant skull. <laughs> Beautiful skull carpet. I don't know if this is easier, but I feel like I need to point out that I have not used a single potion during map two. I used potions in map one, but not map two. And I think that's sort of like my big bugbear about map two is that, okay, more more of what we love sure that makes sense i played how many variants of super mario world right i'm always ready for more but it's it's just it is strictly it's as if every rom hack was basically more 
vanilla smooth. Like, it's the same... Ooh, look at that. Oh, I can't go behind. I want to check out that Merle in the back. Like, it's the same puzzles. It's the same combat. The combats are not harder. The, the maps are not harder to navigate. In fact, I could argue they're almost easier. What with, um... Uh, the thing that I'm trying to think about. <laughs> the three end dungeons that have identical layouts. Alright, I got some time. Let's try and find that missing heart. I'm not promising anything, though, but... If I find it, I find it. I'm going to woods, where there might be things to burn? I don't know. Oh, there's a secret here. Wait, did I ever go in this door? Did I just forget this place existed? I sure did! I just forgot! I just completely forgot about this cave in the corner. And there's also a bonus, probably inside this tree, I'm gonna assume. Yeah, hey. Alright! We did it! Beyond the woods lies a secret graveyard! Alright! We did it, old man! We beat the game! Wow! I don't... It's time for Hyrule to disappear. Oh dear. The adventure is over. We did it. Fought with courage the very last. Was that, hero? It was fun. Did you enjoy it? Yeah. So then, farewell. So, my friend that set this up for me did mention that optimally, in order to present Map 2 in the best light, there's probably a gap that needs to exist between your playthroughs of 1 and 2. And I agree, like, if you give some time, I feel like. The, the similitary the similitaries the similitudes would not be as like absolutely and utterly baffling but you know like normally like I like to have um, I like to play games in their best you know with their best foot forward however like originally didn't decide when you played this, and it was kind of soon, you know, around map one. And so I thought this was probably the most accurate way to play this game. And yeah, quest map two is just... It's a remix that doesn't do anything new. It is strictly a remix. It's interesting. I don't know if it's good, but it's interesting. But see, I feel like BS Zelda map one, though. Or at the very least, whatever, whichever one you play first, is a really interesting way to play this game, to play Zelda. And it's an experience I think would be amazing to revisit with a game that is made for this format. I think you could have, like, really, really cool thing happening. But I don't know, I feel like this is a game that could only exist in that very specific point in time. Like, you do have timed events done now, like, it'll be done for FOMO nonsense. Like, Fortnite does time broadcast events, and, like, that's not exciting. It will have to be tied to the gameplay like this. And I, I just don't know if anyone could pull it out the same way. I thought that was really rad. I'm looking forward to continuing the adventures of Bimmy in the future. You know, maybe as something to come back once a year. Like, a certain other Nintendo IP that I happen to play around one game a year. Something like that. I would like to do that. There's a lot of Zelda games I play. There's a lot I haven't. And I'm, ex I'm excited and interested and sampling from some of both. So, like, I'm not saying no. We'll see what happens. Yeah, speaking of, yeah, that's, that's what's coming up next.